Nvidia is now the most valuable company in the world. And the market cap is worth 3.45 trillion dollars and it just overtook Microsoft again. But this isn't just a Wall Street headline, it's quite a turning point because the new currency of power is no longer data and it's compute and Nvidia sells this to the world. So let's break down how a GPU company became the global backbone of artificial intelligence. This isn't Nvidia first time at the top but this time it feels definitive. So the company earned 44 billion dollars in Q1 revenue and 39 billion was from data centers and the company also saw 1400% of stock growth in the last 5 years so despite a 4.5 billion dollars china export hit nvidia still outperformed expectations all while selling to the biggest names in ai so nvidia is no longer just powering products it's powering nations because 100 plus ai factories are now under construction across the us uae sweden india and beyond all of them running nvidia's full stack and the big shift is that we've moved from training models to running them at scale so openai processed 100 trillion tokens last quarter and nvidia's blackwell chips deliver 30 times more inference throughput and enterprises are deploying 72000 gpus per week because agentic ai is quite compute hungry and nvidia is feeding the beast so meet the blackwell gb200 nvl72 it's not just a chip It's a factory for thought. It's already deployed by Microsoft, Google, Meta, AWS and Oracle. And these chips are reshaping cloud economics and turbocharging token generation. Look, inference is not a feature anymore. It's the main event. Yes, Nvidia lost access to a 50 billion dollar market in China. The H20 ban hurt. But Jensen Huang had a backup plan which was AI supercomputer factories in Texas and Arizona and chip supply chain reshored with TSMC and Foxconn and full stack hardware made in the United States so in one sense the company isn't retreating it's rebuilding the global AI grid from the ground up because so when in AI is the new arms race because AI isn't just a tool anymore it's infrastructure and every country wants its own So from Stargate UAE to Taiwan's National AI Cloud, governments are all treating AI like energy and defense. So Nvidia isn't just enabling this movement; it owns it. We're entering the next reasoning era where AI thinks, plans, and acts, and that shift is triggering an exponential spike in compute demand. And Nvidia is ahead of the curve with agent-optimized chips, softwares like Nemo, and AI-accelerated enterprises like Capital One, Shell, and Yum Brands. So LLMs give us language; agentic AI will give us labor. and nvidia isn't just the most valuable company today it might be the most important one this decade so from ai factories to humanoid robotics and from sovereign infrastructure to everyday productivity this is no longer just about silicon it's about who owns the future and right now the answer is quite simple it is nvidia so let us know what you think in the comments below this is front page by aim tv like share and subscribe and always remember think ai think aim